What's going on ladies and gents? Welcome back to another freshwater chunks fishing video. So I'm I'm itching to catch some bass. Yeah, I'm shaking, I got the twitch. I told Aurelia I had to get out here before the Hurricanes playoff hockey game to catch some fish. So I got some new Guggen products coming in the mail. I'm pretty excited for those to get there, some of the terminal tackle. I'm all out of blazing worms, which sucks because that was such a good bait. It wasn't just like your typical worm or anything. I mean, you know, all these baits out here, they all have the same similarities, but to each its own. So we are gonna wait for those baits to get here, but we're gonna be at this pond. These ponds, there's a bunch of them out here. We got Baxter boy. Hey Baxter. So yeah, we'll get these keys and uh have you guys on the chest mount and on the tripod and we'll be at the pond shortly. Stick with it, stay tuned. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button for your boy. We're almost at, I think, 130 subscribers on YouTube. There will be a giveaway coming up sometime soon. And let's go crank on some bass. We are out here. It's time to get some baits tied on and make some magic happen. So get you guys on the tripod and we'll see you shortly. All right, so we're about to get some baits tied on. That Okeechobee Crawl Bandito bug, and I hope I got some. I see Nuke Punch, Trench Hog. Oh, man. Oh, there we go. Okay. We're just gonna Texas rig this. I think Baxter's enjoying the fishing spot. All right. Let's just see if we can't cast one. Good, looks good. Wish me luck, Baxter. Man, I'm just really hoping we can get on some, some fish today. It's time to get back to my roots and do some bass fishing out here. Oh, there's some bass right here, boy. Yes, sir. Come on, you know you want it. Oh, oh yeah, he sees it. He sees it. You see it. We won't spend too much time at one spot. Look, there's bass right here. There's three of them. Coming right for me. see their tails. Man, they just don't like that thing. This is good Look, they're sitting buddy. right there. They're in a fucking school, dude. Yeah. Natural color bandito bug. We gonna find the we gonna find the color they want. We gonna we will. Oh, I've got green pumpkin on right now. I feel like this is what they want. So we gonna give them what they want. Did you get one? Good job, honey. Baxter, look. Baxter, what have I got? She got her a, she got her a bass. I got it. I can take it out. You can take it out. Go ahead. No. You gotta hold them. Mm. Come on. Okay. Okay. No. Okay. Well, that's number one of the day. Not too bad. Look what you did to my 
my beautiful Texas bag. I just had a bite too. Oh yeah. Well, there you go, honey. See, fuck. How do I it? I'll just tie on a new one. Cool deal. So we got fish number one on the board. She got the skunk off of her back. Now it's time for your boy to get that fish that just ran with my bait. These bass are so shallow, dude. Dang, that was a good bet at one point. I can see that one. Oh, you freaking, dang. He grabbed it, dude. He grabbed it. Will he grab it again? Yep. Dude, that was, that was so cool. That was so cool. That was so awesome. Nice. He's a little guy, but look at that. Look at that line. You just can't beat these, these fish. I mean, you know, it's fun catching tarpon, I'm sure, and redfish and things like that, but can't really beat it. So we're gonna let this guy go. This is number two. Seems like the all natural in the Alabama craw. Seem to be working. Boom. All right time to change ponds but it's still using the all natural i think i might have to tie on something that's a little bit darker i don't know how this all natural is going to do in this water let me see what it looks like eh, it might not be too bad kind of wish i had a spinner bait to be honest with you with this wind I just lost one right here at my feet. Oh shit. What hell you got on? I got the all natural on now. Yeah. Need some fish on the board. Pretty sure something thumped it. this how you doing what's up back to the boy we gonna rock with that green pumpkin purple this water is just pretty dark so we'll do that see how this color goes I've had good luck with this color a bandito bug in the past Especially on uh, some jigs. There we go. Found a color. Yep. Yeah, it is. Have to look that up. Thank you. Thanks for chomping.
feels good to fish at the coast for a week and have decent results. I mean, we didn't catch anything like crazy, but we caught fish and that's what matters. But so it feels good to be able to do that and then come back here and catch these largemouth. Trying to cast as close to the island as I can. Come on. Where you at, big Billy? I haven't caught a fish out of this side, so hopefully we can snag one. That'd be kind of cool. It's always exciting catching fish in new bodies of water. Here we go. Oh, you. Oh. Drop the ball on that one. Lost that one fish like right at my feet, dude. We're gonna be doing a another video very soon of uh, using some special baits. It's not really a bait that's in Bass Pro Shop. I believe it's a bait that should be in Bass Pro Shop because I've had good luck on it. Um, it's locally made in Raleigh, so I'm excited to use it. You know, use a hometown bait that somebody local has made. Yeah, won't spill the beans right now, but I'll give you guys more details in the next video. So it'll just be a specific bait video for their baits. These fish get, these fish are weird in this pond. Never caught a fish out of this pond. Man, I, and I know there's bass in here. I know it. I've seen them. But I've never walked around the entire thing. Dude, he wrecked my, he wrecked it. Well, we're gonna have to call it because we gotta go anyways. We gotta watch the playoff game, but. I appreciate you guys watching my videos. If you haven't already done so, please hit that subscribe button. Also hit that thumbs up and the notification bell. He really, really messed me up. I'm telling you, man, that was a good one. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. We'll be back at you, at you with another heater very soon.